it's overcast and it's cold. G'day guys, it's overcast and it's cold. Probably not going to catch anything, but that will never stop me trying. And the river's actually dropped a little bit from its normal level, as you can probably see, despite the rain we've had recently. I'm not too worried about that. The, the water's not as clear as it usually would be. Not that this is a clear waterway anyway, but it is murkier than normal. So worms should be the ideal choice, especially given the rain we've had, because any worms up on that hill there that have risen to the surface in the moist ground will have gotten washed down by all the fresh rain into the water. So there should be worms present in the water. That should be what the fish are looking for anyway. And that's why I've chosen that as my bait today. I have a sip of me takeaway coffee that my wife lovingly made for me before I left the house. Just what I need on a cold day. Mmm. Nectar of the gods. Second only to beer. <laughs> I've actually got a couple of friends that'll be showing up shortly and they're bringing some worms the same as me, but he's also bringing some barty grubs and some cheese. So we'll have a few options in the water, we'll see what happens. There's certainly plenty of signs of fish in the area. The real question is, are they feeding? Only time will tell. I haven't had a touch on the rods in about 15 minutes, but it's still early days. I'll be here for a couple of hours yet. Got him. Yeah, a little yellow. <laughs> there you go, guys. Not bad at all. Look at the saw Yeah. He's tawny. Yeah. Oh, well. Open your mouth. Let me have a look at you. Tiny little yellow belly. This trip was not in vain. There we go, guys. Hopefully, you can see that all right. It's starting to get a bit darker, but I've caught something. I came out to go fishing and I ended up catching, so that's always a bonus. I'm going to get him straight back. There you go, mate. Off you go. <laughs> just had a nibble, so I picked it up and then the line just kept dancing, dancing, dancing. I thought, he's not having a good go, I might as well just strike and I got him. So, <laughs> Awesome. Oh. Is that a good boy? Nah, probably about the same size as the last one. Still worm, I'll get it back out there. Got him. Put my light on. What have I got? Another little yellow. A bit bigger than the last one. Not by much. Oh goodness, how have I got this guy hooked? It's in the tongue. Definitely not in the gills, so I can get the hook out. To go get my pliers. All right, mate. Let me get this hook out so you can go. There we go, hook's out. You're all good to go back in the water now. I'll let you breathe for a minute. I'm gonna let you breathe in the water for a sec if I... No, not there, too steep. Come up here. <laughs> here we go, nice flat spot. Let you have a breathe, like that. Oh, there's a little minnow, right there. <laughs> Let you have a breathe in the water and then we'll have a good look at you and then we'll let you go. Alright? Alright. Beautiful little yellow belly of about 23 centimetres. Very tiny. 
All right, mate, off you go. Back in the water. Ready? You ready to go? When you're ready. You're free. There you go, look. Straight under that log there. He's happy and healthy. You can still see him down there. You probably can't though, it's very dark. <laughs> well there you go guys, a couple of little yellow belly late in autumn in conditions that aren't ideal when it's starting to get pretty cold i'm stoked uh, if you haven't already please consider subscribing because it would really help my channel leave a thumbs up in the comment if you enjoyed the video and i'll catch us in the next one